just 24 hours ago, these two were strangers who happened to be at the same place at the right life-saving moment. The 13-year-old was on his bike yesterday, uh, attempting to cross the frozen Lake Barren when the ice gave in below. The boy fell through and luckily was rescued by a bystander who was hearing the screams. The two met today, even embracing a traumatic situation for both involved because the rescuer risked his own life on the fragile ice. And we were able to experience just how thin and dangerous this ice can be, of course, in a safe environment with the help of Lake Valley Fire crawling across the same crackling ice to the same spot where that boy fell in. Usually it's just it's like when you go out skiing, it's like your arms and your hands and stuff are cold, but like it was like inside it was really cold and I couldn't I couldn't like think clearly. I was like, oh my God. I was terrified. I was terrified even at the idea of going out there, the, the whole thing. There was never a moment where I felt like this is going fine until we were fully off the ice. When the, when, uh, even when I started going out there, I just felt fear. And, uh, and when I, we got him um, and, and the ice was breaking, I again was um, you know, just terrified. And Lake Valley Fire transported the teen to the hospital for severe hypothermia. But lucky, luckily, as we can see today, the teen made a full recovery. But this really is just a reminder. With warming temperatures, the ice should just be avoided at all costs. Responders say this also applies to pets because they have actually rescued dogs after falling through the ice, playing catch. The dog course, takes all yeah. the like into the lake, falls in, and then they have to conduct a rescue. Wow, what an, um, just an amazing story that that guy happened to be there. What was that like for you, Vicki, actually being in there? <laughs> You know what? I just kind of kept it to myself. You know, I couldn't really say no when you're surrounded by a half dozen emergency responders. Um, but it definitely was. Um, my heart was beating a little fast. But the moment that we were in, you could really just feel how thin the ice was. And actually, when they were pulling me out, more caved in. So that wow. actually, that hole in the ice got a lot bigger. So we got to see just how fragile that ice is. You get a